Hello guys, welcome to Yama. In this video, you will learn user defined function types in C. Function types fall into four types with respect to parameters and written value, namely without parameters and without written value. Next, with parameters, without written value. Next, without parameters, with written value. And next, with parameters, with written value. Now, let's start with without parameters and without written value. In this example, you can see a function called named sum without parameters in brackets. And you can also observe no written statement and written type mentioned as void. It indicates no written value. Execution goes like function prototype void sum main function call sum with no parameters control goes to function definition sum and then the variables a b s are declared and the values are assigned next then s is equal to a plus b 2 plus 3 sum is stored in s printf prints output sum is equal to 5 next example is on with parameters and without written value you can see a function called named sum with parameters 2 and 3 and you can also observe no written statement and the written type will be void now the program starts with function prototype the main and then the function called sum of 2 comma 3 control goes to sum of int a comma int b with it 2 is stored in int a and 3 is stored in int b then int s is declared to store the sum then s is equal to a plus b and then the print of prints output as sum is equal to 5 and here comes without parameters without written value here you can see a function call named sum without parameters and you can also observe a written statement present in the function as it returns integer value we write written type as int now first function prototype main and declare n to store the written value now function call sum and then control goes to function definition int sum then variable declaration s i j are declared next s is equal to i plus j that is 3 plus 5 8 is stored in s then written s the written value 5 is written to calling function and 8 is stored in n then print of print sum is equal to 8 next comes with parameters and with written value here you can see a function call named sum with parameters 3 and 5 and you can also observe a written statement present in function now first the function prototype next main n variable to store the written value n is equal to sum of 3 comma 5 function call passes two parameters 3 and 5 to function definition and that is uh, sum of int i comma int j and then declare s to store the sum then i plus j that is 3 plus 5 and then 8 is stored in int s then returns s now return value s to uh, calling function and 8 is stored in n and then print of prints sum is equal to 8 thanks for watching our video for more videos do subscribe to our channel 3mm 3 minutes master if you like hit the like button and bell icon there and do share with your friends don't forget to drop a comment